Hello everyone, welcome back to Radiology Med Easy, your all time favorite YouTube channel. Let's see today's case. So, our case today is a 50 year old patient presented with abdominal distension, pain, and vomiting for two days duration. It's, uh, these are progressive symptoms. So, this is a frontal or anteroposterior radiograph of the abdomen in a skeletally mature male patient because the I said male because the pubic symphysis has acute angle the pubic angle and uh, so you can see a grossly distended bowel loop here right that distended bowel loop extends from right iliac fossa to the epigastric region and it has a pseudo kidney appearance kidney shape pseudo kidney appearance and it is more than 9, nine centimeters in diameter roughly 9 centimeters so pseudo kidney pseudo kidney appearance usually 9 centimeter diameter in the RIF region and you can see some dilated small bowel loops yes these are complete rings valvular conventors they are displaced due to this enlarged bowel loops small bowel loops are dilated so small bowel obstruction is there and uh, you can't see any dilated bowel loops in the uh, right side of the abdomen in right corner so ascending colon is not dilated and uh, you don't see any air within the bowel wall no pneumatosis intestinalis and no obvious bowel loops outside the pelvic brim you don't see rectal layer in this region so in this case the diagnosis is proximal large bowel obstruction proximal large bowel obstruction due to cecal valvulus cecal valvulus is the diagnosis <coughs> differential diagnosis is sigmoid valvulus so in sigmoid valvulus you see a coffee bean appearing large mass in the left side of the abdomen extending upwards to L T to L level and it, it doesn't have frustration sequel value sometimes have frustration and there are dilated large bowel loops in sigmoid valvulus proximal to the obstruction but in sequel valvulus there are mainly dilated small bowel loops and when you consider about the age sigmoid valvulus occurs above 60 years age but sequel valvulus occurs 30 to 60 years of age so here you get a coffee bean appearance sigmoid valvulus in sequel valvulus you get a pseudo kidney appearance so sequel valvulus usually occurs due to problems in the mesentery or malrotations and uh, cecal mesentery it rotates around the cecal mesentery so you have to look for the complications like perforation so you have to see the intraperitone area and uh, any ischemic features portovenous gas those are the complications you have to look for so next line of investigation is contrast NSCT abdomen. So that concludes case number 2 in abdomen. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe for more videos like this.